Hello, Madonna fans and friends, and Merry Christmas. And I'm so happy to be here with you guys celebrating today on Christmas as we have come to the close of Madonna's Celebration Tour in 2023 with a few shows in the United States. So we'll talk about that, and we'll also talk about some other quick news and the announcement of our Christmas contest at Madonna Everybody Fan Club on Facebook. So if you are on Facebook, you'll definitely want to check that out. But anyway, I want to start off with saying thank you so much, everyone, for being a part of this community, for joining us, for subscribing, for commenting, sharing your experiences of the celebration tour so far, all the European dates. And of course, we've had a few dates in New York and Washington, D.C. We want to get into some of the latest uh, news about that. And we just want to say we are so excited because she will be continuing on on January 8th. I believe we'll be going to Boston next. And we want you to be a part of the excitement both here and in Facebook on our Celebration Tour group. That's Madonna, the Celebration Tour EFC Hub, where we'll be keeping track of all the dates, all the performances, any changes, the set list, anything that could happen between now and then. So we hope that you will uh, join us there or keep track of it here with us because we will be dropping the news once it happens. So let's get into some news. Of course, the last big news we had was at the last, the very last show of 2023, which was uh, in Washington, D.C. And of course, Madonna was having some holiday fun by bringing out Santa as a special ballroom guest for the Vogue performance. And Santa took a little bit of a spill um, that evening and was it was very interesting, entertaining. Now, this photo, I was uh, listening to MLVC podcast, and I wonder if this is the photo that Stefan, who runs that podcast, took, because when he described it, it sounded a lot like this photo. I got this from, actually, an article on the Google News search. A beautiful photo of the two of them. So, Stefan, if this is your photo, Stefan, you got to check out his podcast, MLVC. Um, you can find it. Uh, I think it's on Spotify, um, but also on YouTube. I check it out on YouTube, and he tells you all about his experience taking video footage and photos of that moment, and it went all over and went viral. And he has interviewed the Santa, the Santa that fell down uh, during that performance, uh, what exactly had happened, so you'll want to check that out. Um, but also she had some amazing shows coming home to Brooklyn, New York, and giving a hometown performance. She was so excited to be there once again and to start off her North American leg there, uh, singing I Love New York during the Burning Up segment. And that was really awesome. Um, just in good spirits, bringing her boyfriend on as a guest one of the nights. And um, also Julia Garner. We know that she is in talks for possibly being Madonna in the biopic. So that made sense for the, the for her to be there as well as for her boyfriend to be there, you know, bringing in uh, friends and people that she's close to. And then, of course, Washington, D.C. with Santa was was amazing, um, really added to the fun of the holiday season. But what have you been enjoying so far of the United States shows? We don't have that many of them, um, but they've been memorable so far. So. Uh, again, this is a great photo, Stefan. If you took this, uh, we, we love this photo. And in other news, I've been reading uh, recently that the Glastonbury might not be happening. I don't know. I think it's still kind of an iffy situation because Madonna does want to do a full-scale representation of her show that she's currently doing as a performance at Glastonbury. And they're not sure if they can accommodate the staging that big. So... They're, you know, kind of in talks about it, and the news items, news items are saying it might not happen, but we're hopeful that maybe something can be worked out for her to be able to perform there. But then again, if she does decide to um, continue and expand the tour to South America and other areas, perhaps it might be for the best. I don't know. When is Glastonbury held? Is that That's a summer thing. So we have to wait and see, as well as many other possibilities in the future. This picture is gorgeous. I, have, I just had to share it. Uh, Jeannie Buxo, 
shared this with me and she uh, ran uh, is running Madonna's World and um, has a pop-up shop um, uh, let me see I'm trying to think Madonna is it Madonna pop-up shop I'll have to look that up um, in another video and share with you guys if that's still running but I wanted to share this photo she sent me she did not take this picture but she want, said I was free to share it so I uh, love this shot, um, absolutely beautiful. And also, what are you guys hoping for in this next leg of the tour? Do you think she might release a song, uh, a new song during this time, 2024, new music maybe? She had a lot of stuff she was working on um, last summer, so it's possible. There was the Katy Perry, there was the Max Martin, possibly something Stuart Price and her have cooked up while she's been working on the tour. Uh, anything's possible. Um, you know, we, we realized, you know, uh, soon enough that the music video rumor was merely a commercial. Uh, still amazing, but we didn't get that, you know, that that we thought we might have. But it's always a possibility. Madonna has made music videos during tours. So, we you know, we had Jump and we had uh, Turn Up the Radio. So it is possible. Um, so tell us what you're looking forward to, what you're hoping for next year. We will definitely have a year-end wrap-up coming up here for the new year and recap the year that was. So you'll want to check that out and relive some of those moments throughout the year, um, including the announcement of the tour back in January on, on up to where we are now. Uh, I'll be uh, putting that together. Also wanted to announce here, just put it up today, but for Christmas in our Facebook group, Madonna Everybody Fan Club, we are having this contest to win this t-shirt. You want to go over there and join and become a member, as well as um, participate in the contest question. And we'll be uh, picking and selecting a winner to get this bad girl t-shirt. It's double-sided, has the same image on both sides. Uh, silk screened and very beautiful and we would love to give it away to a very lucky fan to wear at the shows upcoming shows so uh, again thank you so much everyone i want to just send out a happy holiday greeting to all of you and to thank you for being a part of our community whether you're on our facebook groups and we have the madonna everybody fan club and madonna the celebration tour efc hub or you're here uh, following along as we go through Another amazing year of touring and exciting moments with Madonna and being a fan. And we just were so happy to have you. And thank you. And um, I hope you have a wonderful holidays, wonderful Christmas with Santa Baby. And I will see you for the recap of the year that was 2023 uh, coming up next week. So thank you again, everyone. Merry Christmas. Are you looking for a great Madonna fan club to join? We have a place you need to be at, at Madonna Everybody Fan Club, not only this channel, but we also have a Facebook group and a Facebook page titled Madonna Everybody Fan Club. You should definitely come check us out and join. We have contests, fan of the month, features, articles, and a great community for you to get to know and share your Madonna love with other fans. We also would love for you to comment, like, and subscribe on this video and tell us what you think. What do you like to see more of in this channel? We're here for you and Madonna fans rock. So have a great day. Thank you.